So the first pass of my edge to edge quilting has uh, finished stitching and I'm ready to nest. So what I like to do is bring my machine down to one of the lowest points on my pattern and I put my needle down um, into the pattern, into my quilt. So let me move my camera. So to nest this pattern, I'm just going to click on my nesting icon and the screen tells you exactly what to do. And I make a point to read it slowly and um, think about every step before I actually make the step. If I don't and I click through the steps too fast, I can make a mistake and I get kind of stuck. Um, so it tells me select and mark your nesting point. Since I put my needle down into my quilt, that is my nesting point. And so it, that's how I mark it. And I'm gonna say check. And now it tells you roll the quilt. And I'm going to roll it really slowly since my needle is down. And I roll it to where I'm ready to do my second pass. So roll the quilt. Okay, I did that. Move the machine to your nesting point. Since my needle is down, it didn't move, so it is at the nesting point. So I say, okay. And it puts in a second pattern. So the grade pattern you see up here is your first pass. And the second one down here is your next pass that it's going to quilt. At this point, you can double check your spacing. And since we set that before we stitched our first pass, it's good to go. So all I have to do is say, okay, and it's ready to quilt. So let's say I was clicking through those or I got to this point and I moved something and I click on my um, nesting icon and I just clicked through these and I think I'm ready to quilt, but now when I hit my start, it's going to go way down um, to a third row. And we have not quilted our second row. So this isn't going to work for us. And you're going to be in a panic. See, my first, my start should be all the way up here. So I want to show you how, that, how to fix that. It's really easy. So I'm going to X out of this and I'm going to move my machine and if I have to roll my quilt back, I will, but I'm going to put my machine on the first start point and you can see I've lined it up up here um, or I haven't lined it up because it doesn't know where it's at. But I put it in my needle down into where my start point was. So I'm going to go into edit. I'm going to go into my move menu. And I'm going to say move start. And say okay. So now it's showing our start is way up here above our quilt area. And that is fine because we have rolled our quilt and um, that's the way it's supposed to um, look at this point. So I'm going to come back and I'm gonna go ahead and start it and let it take just that one stitch. 
and then X out of there. Now I'm going to say nest and I'm going to nest it again. I'm going to bring my needle down and say select and mark your nesting point. Okay, roll the quilt. I'm not going to roll it because we already have. So, okay, move the machine to your nesting point. Since your needle is down, it's already there. Okay, it shows our second row, just like we want it. Okay, so nesting is complete and it's ready to go. So now with doing that, The machine moved to the next point exactly where it's supposed to be. And ready to stitch. <laughs>